guys, it's Yvette and I am here for Vlogmas Day 12. Today is Sunday, December 12th and I am ready to get my stuff open. So let's start off with the cotton cuts. And I, so I, I found this little card that came with it. It does say Rosa's Holiday Your Way Countdown Box. So that's what they call it. They don't call it an advent calendar. Okay, I just wanted to clear that up because it's important. She named it and that's what we should call it. I'm gonna try really hard. I might have to keep that card here like forever and ever, but I'll try to remember. <laughs> okay, so here is the envelope for day 12. Let's check it out. Okay, the thought of the day. Creativity is intelligence having fun. There's that. And then here is the fabric. This looks very Coriota-like. Coriodur, not Yoda. Which, <laughs> goodness gracious. <laughs> Um, let me see if they have some silver. I think that they, oh, they do. It's Springbrook by Corey Yoder. <laughs> it's very, uh, this looks like her fabric. So, you know, there you go. Okay, so there's that guy. And let's close this one up. And we're going to move on to Allison Glass. The sticker calendar, and this one actually says Advent Calendar. So this is an Advent Calendar from Allison Glass Stickers. Uh, okay, number 12. Oh, here's number 12 right here. Boop, there it is. And let's see. Oh, it's a thimble. Cute. It's very cute. Okay. There's the sticker of the day, and then we have... Of course, Crimson Tate. <laughs> and let's pull out number 12. Oh, how festive. I love it. Very nice. Okay. Oh, by the way, I have finally been able to start looking at comments from Vlogmas. You guys, I'm way behind, I know. Um, Jonathan, you can't go in there, baby. No, no, this for mommy. Look, see, he likes this. Is that what you like? Yeah. I know, the cats are like a herd of elephants down there, right? He's like, I don't know what's going on. Okay, but those are for mom, okay? All right. Oh my goodness, we got a sticker. It's a uh, book. And it says, the box car. Okay, honestly, you can give me all the stickers you want. I'd be very happy. JB, are you wanting everybody to check out your ears? Make sure they're clean. Yeah, okay. I think they're clean, buddy. Okay, oh. All right, seriously, I don't know what this fabric is, but I love it. I, I love it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There's gotta be a salvage. <laughs> Oh my goodness, there's no salvage. Okay, uh, y'all, if you know what it is, please comment below. I really need to know. Um, hold on, I'm gonna open the whole thing because you gotta see the whole thing. This is uh, this is gorgeous, honestly. Oh my goodness. Okay, jelly bean, no, you can't have that. That's mommy's. Okay, look, what is this, guys? Somebody to jelly bean. You know what? I think he wants the little squiggly papers. You want a little squiggly paper? Look, let me give you one. One, you want this? You want that? Here you go. Yeah? He's gonna have fun with that for an hour now. Okay, so here it is. You guys have got to tell me what this is. I have no idea. I have not seen this, but I love it. Look, look at the little sea of fishes. And then they're all the way, they're like going all the way through the water. And then the little, right here, with like the little hearts and the stars, and I think that those are, I would call them surfboards, personally. Okay, I just, I need to know. Somebody's going to know. Please tell me. I need to know. <laughs> I want to know who this designer is. Um, 
how, how have I not ever seen this? Okay. And then here is the solid to go with it. This lovely blue color. Oh my goodness. That it's gorgeous. Okay. So those are my countdown to fun advent countdown boxes. <laughs> And so I was sitting and trying to think of what I wanted to open for today. Um, there's one thing that was a possibility, but I really want to wait until maybe like tomorrow. Um, so this today I am going to open. This is an equal opportunity event doesn't open anything situation. Um, this is my fig tree. This is the last fig tree I got. Uh, and I'm pretty sure this came in October. So <laughs> I'm going to pop this open and we will check it out <laughs> I mean it says fig tree and I haven't ordered anything so it must be the box okay yes it is <laughs> okay so this is uh, the little box of figs 2021 box number three the Christmas box and I know all the information is on this piece of paper so I'm going to put it to the side for a second um, I'm going to pull that out I'm going to pull out the box which again doesn't have a sticker on top I, I need to just not focus on that right okay I'm going to not focus on that all right so let me scooch this down Okay, so we have, um, okay, so that you can make a sparkling stars flower sack towel using leftovers from the main project. Um, they're basically making three simple sawtooth star blocks and then putting them on um, a flower cloth towel. Flower sack towel, sorry, got that wrong. Okay, the pattern that we got, uh, it says it's a perfect weekend scrap, pro scrap project with a fun optimal, with a fun optional 3D bow. <laughs> okay, so here it is, it's called Holly Berries. It's very pretty and you can uh, put this bow on if you want. It sounds like um, you probably like actually get a bow and then just like put it on somehow. Um, I, this the only way I could think it would be 3D. So let's see. Uh, this, the finished size is 23 inches square and it seems pretty simple and quick to go together just like they said. Okay, so step 10 is optional. This is the, the bow. It says if you're going to use this as a wall hanging, you might try adding a little 3D bow to the front of your wreath. Use red print number three and trim your yardage to five inch strip. Okay, and they tell you how to make the bow and then you can put it, you can either stitch it onto your wreath or you can put it on with a safety pin so that you can either, you could take it off if you want, you know, that kind of thing. Um, so I'm looking at the instructions and it looks pretty pretty simple um okay cute that's really cute um let's see what's in the box <laughs> okay i'm gonna go through um what it what the box goodies are inside the first thing is the main project which is holly berries which you just saw that's the pattern um there is a little project and that is the flower sack kitchen towels um, that we saw. They actually gave us a flower sack, flower sack kitchen towel in the box. Okay, let's go through. This is, are these stickers? These are stickers. And these are Christmas labels. Starting with this year, we decided to give everyone two stickers. Oh no, that's not it. Is it? No. No. First of all, because we got four of these. Uh, 
Um, maybe these just little line yap. I don't know. I'm going to put these to the side. I don't think that that's what, that, what it is on here. I think it, that's something else. I hope. Um, <laughs> so we have a little bag that says Built Quilt. Um, BuiltQuilt.com. And th these are bamboo coasters. So let me pull them out. If you guys get this, then you already have it. You know everything that's inside. <laughs> um, okay, so here is their uh, card. And if you want to go on Instagram, they are at BuiltQuilt. And... Uh, build quilt celebrating quilt patterns beyond the cloth awesome okay so here's some of their designs and more of their designs and these are really pretty you can see the star block other the blocks inside and here's the other one there are two of them inside those are really pretty okay um we have some red floss and this is for the little project so this is for the sour the flower sack towels <laughs> i don't know why that's such a tongue twister for me but anyway so this will be used with that um if you decide you want to do that and ooh, we got some pretty scissors Ooh, y'all know me hold on i gotta take this out this says Figgy Snips Exclusive Scissors. We are so very excited to share these with you guys. Created for us by our friends over at It's So Emma. These are the perfect sewing companions. They are strong, sh sharp, and beautiful with the most perfect elongated handles to re reduce finger fatigue. And that's that's really nice. Look at Look how pretty this is. It's got a little sheath. And it is like pewter. It's really pretty. And, oh my goodness, they're a little bit longer and they are very sharp. Um, I My new p favorite pair of snips right here. I am, oh my goodness, thank you so much. I love this. I'm going to put these right here. They are not going anywhere. <laughs> um, okay, and then we have quilt soap. Um, Orvis Delicate Fabric Soap. This soap got our attention not only because of its reputation for biodegradable safe soap for vintage and delicate quilts, but also because of its fun retro feeling packaging. Perfect as a stocking stuffer for yourself or a quilty friend too. And here it is. So yeah, very. it is very interesting packaging. And it feels, I mean, it's definitely a liquid. Uh, and it feels like it's got a little bit of thickness to it, which is nice. Um, okay, awesome. And now we are at all the fabric. And on the bottom, we have um, a pin, which I'm happy about. I collect pins. This is a Christmas rose hips enamel pin. I designed this pin to mimic one of my all time favorite fig tree patterns, rose hips, in a classic red and white color combo. Perfect as a little Christmas adornment on your sweater, jacket, or your bag, tote, notions catch all, or even your bulletin board. I end up finding useless uses, sorry, <laughs> endless uses. God. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> for these classy little embellishments and love collecting them. Oh, jelly bean baby. What? Okay. Um, let me scooch that. I'll scooch it. <laughs> I love enamel pins. I do collect them. So thank you very much for that. Um, okay. So um, I, un unfortunately, I, I don't know. I, I don't, this can't possibly be. Okay, these are the only stickers that I see inside the box. And they're saying that this is supposed to be the sticker. Uh, 
to put on the front of our box. I <laughs> Okay, there it is. Because actually I'm, I'm reading further down and it does say that this is it. Um, okay. Um, at least we still get the green box, I guess. I, I'll just kind of put it that way. Um, these are the fabrics that are inside. I always love the fabrics for sure. So here is the first fabric that is inside. Here it is. And let's see, are they going to tell us about the fabric? I don't think so. Um, I don't think they tell us about, it. I mean, obviously it's fig tree fabric, but I thought maybe they would be like a, I'd probably have to like read the pattern to see how much we are getting of everything. But these are the fabrics that are included inside. Here's the first one. And here is this, the second one. <laughs> and everybody can let me know if J JB's ears are clean enough. You know, we'll, we'll let him know he's doing a good job. <laughs> this is the third one. I do love all their fabrics. They're so pretty. Oh, look at this one. This is pretty. Very, very pretty. I love that little design. I think it's a leaf, but really I don't even care what it is. It's very cute. And here is the next one. And this guy. This one's super cute. Oh my goodness, the next one. <laughs> I like the best, I think. <laughs> and this is the last one, and I and of course it's the one we have the least of. <laughs> and I really like it. Very cute. I have not seen this one, so I don't I don't know if this is for and of course the selvage. Oh, this is strawberries and rhubarb. Oh, cool. I love it. I do love that. That is a, a darling print. And then, of course, we have the sour, the flower sack towel. <laughs> so there it is. Okay. Um, so that is our fig tree that we got in October. This is the Christmas box. I'm going to put everything back inside. Except for those scissors, because those those are staying out and with me. Because <laughs> I love those. Okay, let me put that in there. And I'm probably going to, let me see, can I fit this in here? Yeah, I can fit this in here. I'm just going to, like, fold it over. And I can probably put this guy back in there so I remember. Okay. So there's the fig tree. And so it comes to the end of the video and I have um, a couple things to do as far as um, wrapping up this, vi this video. The first thing is to tell you that Stephanie's word of the day is trees. And uh, the next thing is to tell you that I am having a giveaway with this video and I have just received uh, within the past week, a collection called Calendar Girls. Um, and it's by Anne Keegan. Some, she's got three names. And I always forget the end. Is it here? It's got to be here. There it is. Anne Keenan Higgins. Anne Keenan Higgins. And this um, collection is completely adorable. It has um, 11 different SKUs and then there are three panels. And so I decided that I'm going to give four people each a half yard bundle and one each of the, um, of the panels. So I'm going to show you um, everything that I have and that you'll be getting. This is the first fabric. And 
and this is the second one. They do have um, a little girl doing something for every month in here. This is the third fabric. Number four. Number five. As you can see, they're going through uh, the seasons of the year. So you have um, pretty much all, well, you have all the seasons uh, in at, at least one piece. And here's the next one. And this is a little blender. And you can see people like uh, girls walking their dogs or riding a bike and um, different stuff like that. And we have this guy. This is the one that I used to make my drawstring bag. If you guys watched that uh, yesterday, Stephanie, Stephanie and I sewed together drawstring bags. And this is the main fabric I used. And here's another one. There's a little sayings on it, like, hello, sunshine, time flies when you're having fun. <laughs> it's very pretty. And then you got one with the ladies wearing all the hats. There's a whole bunch of different little hats on there, depending on the season. And then I will show you each of the three panels. I'll try to get the whole thing in there. Um, they are... Um, 24 inches by 42, 44 inches, um, something like that. And so it's a nice big panel. And you'll see, um, let me make sure I'm getting it all. These are like some small squares. Okay, that's the first one. And y'all know that I really want to sit here and fold it all back up, but I won't. I'm just going to kind of <laughs> do that. <laughs> all right, so here's the second one. Let's see. This, these are a um, little bit bigger panels. They're super cute. They they kind of remind me of like um, the collections that you'll see when like Paris is the theme. And I really like it. I, I just, I've always liked those um, fabric collections. And then the third one. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> it's interesting. I'm I'm sitting here and I'm making the video and um in my mind, I'm kind of thinking, gosh, it feels uh, very subdued here today. And it probably is just because it's getting later at night and everybody's kind of calmed down a little bit. Um, so anyway, I am going to um, give away four half yard bundles of this collection. And all you need to do is um, just make a nice comment down below about anything you want to talk about in this video and I will pull four people um, about 24 hours from the time this 
posts and I will announce the winners in a subsequent video for Vlogmas. Uh, so thanks so much for coming by and watching the video. Hopefully you are subscribed and you will come back for more. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.